There comes a day in every superhero's life when he meets his match. The day he's going to lose the shirt off his back. And that's my final offer. <laughs> what you doing, Milo? Shh. Trading pokey teenage space slacker cards almost got a complete set. See? Slouch, Sneer, Spud, and the Snark. I'm in the middle of a trade for the rarest space slack card of all. Whatever. So, Wendell, all set? Mm, I don't know. What have you got to sweeten the deal? Uh-oh. Flamingo! <gasps> it's a little kid in trouble. Hold on a sec. To sweeten the deal? You got the tights off my butt, Wendell. What else can I give you? I don't know. What else can you give me? Captain, a gigantic disaster is just waiting to happen. I'm in the middle of a trade here. Can I wait? Uh-oh. Flamingo! <gasps> no! You have to come now! <laughs> <gasps> because it's not like this is going to fit me anyway, with me being an, an eighth, eighth of, of an, an inch, inch taller. taller. Captain, come on! You can do this later! Ugh, she annoys me. The trade is off. Man, this had better be big. <laughs> Whoa! <gasps> this is big! I told you it couldn't wait. <laughs> Quick, take cover before it blows! <laughs> Be the world's biggest bubble gum bubble. What if it pops? The explosion could rattle the very foundation of the earth or make a very gooey pink mess. Thank goodness I got here in time. Ew! Ugh. Huh? Ah! Butterfly! <laughs> butterfly! <laughs> Person, stop! Whoa! 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 That's gonna cause trouble. Let's just see how much. We have a sticky situation. Yikes! Kirsten's really making a mess of things, and the problems are multiplying. Multiplying! <gasps> Wait a second! Multiplying. That's math. Bobblehead and Einstein can help us out with this one. Because if there's anyone who knows math, it's Einstein. Huh? How can a doll help you, Einstein? <gasps> Is yeah. this problem solvable by math alone? Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh -huh. Is the fact that Kirsten is collecting stuff on her sticky gum head a terrifying development? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Huh. Do you have some valuable advice for solving this sticky situation? Yeah, yes. Yeah, yeah. Einstein, are you going to answer yes to everything he asks you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Making this a complete waste of time? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hmm. So, on to plan B then? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow, Einstein. Thanks for your help. <laughs> Hang on, Kirsten. Aha! Plan B. That tiny thing? This <laughs> tiny thing is the world's largest personal freestanding launchable water balloon. If brain power can't fix this situation, then brute force can. <laughs> <laughs> Except for the gum. On the bright side, it's very clean gum. <gasps> Captain, <laughs> quick! Before she wanders off and sticks to more stuff. Uh, look, a tool made specifically for this problem. A toilet plunger? Ugh. It's like it was made for her face. But that's not nice. No time for niceties, Lizbeth. I've got a little girl's face to plunge. <laughs> it's working! <laughs> Uh-oh. Get! Get! Traction! Go! Uh, uh, limit! Your luck is stretched to the limit, and you're in a very, very... Please don't say it. Please don't say it. 
sticky situation. He said it. Stay tuned. Consult my bird brain about this. What should I try next? Bird brain? I'm working on it. Bird brain, what's the problem? Just give me a second. <gasps> wow, my bird brain's never let me down before. Maybe there's finally a problem that's just too big to solve. Maybe it's time to call in the pokey teenage space slackers in person. What? <laughs> It's true, for all of our six. You'd better call them. You've reached PTSS headquarters. We're microwaving burritos and whining about our futures. So leave a message and we might get back to you. Beep. Uh, uh, um, hi. Uh, we have an emergency situation we need help with. But then again, even though I collect their cards and everything, little kids are still my turn. Yeah, but I just... And while I find the whole teen slacker giant pants wearing slang filled time wasting thing kind of amusing, that doesn't mean I'm gonna let them show me how it's done. That's the spirit, Captain. I just hope it's not too... Come on, huh? let's show them how it's done. Slacker style. Wait. Wow, the pokey teenage space slackers aren't nearly as pokey as their names would suggest. Come on, let's get her out of her gum face prison already. <laughs> nice dilemma. Go away. I don't need you. I've got Captain Flamingo. He'll save me. See? Little kids, believe in me. That's right, Captain. You start saving Kirsten, and I'll get the slackers arguing to buy you some time. So, guys, uh, <laughs> which is better? Microwave burritos or microwave nachos? Uh, huh? yeah. Whatever. So what's your heroic plan, Captain? And where can we go that the space slackers won't think um, of? I know, the hockey rink. Slackers wouldn't be caught dead exercising. They'll never find us there. <laughs> okay, Kirsten, don't move while I think of a way out of this mess. Oops. <laughs> Hey, she stopped every shot. Yeah, she must be the new draft pick. It's not sticky anymore. Aw, oh, man. My bird brain's being weirdly quiet today. Come on, help me out here. Captain? Not now. Captain? The flamingo is about to crack this wide open. Captain? Huh? Sorry to interrupt your super thinking, but thank you for saving me from that awful gum. Huh? Captain, I tried, but I couldn't hold them off any longer. Okay, oh. Kirsten, these gum scrapers are gonna hurt a lot. But the sooner we get at it, the sooner you can start healing. See? I told you the captain could do it. Wow. Huh? How'd you do that? It's all in a day's work for Captain Flamingo. He's my hero. <gasps> Mine too, Kirsten. Mine too. <laughs> nice tight. Gee, thanks. Whatever. That's my final offer. I don't know, Wendell. What have you got to sweeten the deal? After all, these pokey teenage space slacker cards are all signed. Mm, fine. Even though you're an eighth of an inch shorter, you're still cooler than me. Is that what you want to hear? Is that it? Yeah, <laughs> pretty much. So do we have a deal? And with the taste of success, sweet on his lips, Captain Flamingo, with a dignified air, rubs his cousin's nose in it. Sure, Wendell. I'll trade you for these. 
But the new card they just issued, the most collectible of them all, I'm gonna have to keep that one for myself. Captain Flamingo! Looking out for kids in a big way. Whatever. Sports wildlife everywhere.